good morning good morning good morning peeps to another day in Japan we are in Osaka this is day seven of the 10 day Tripadil tour it's going to be another long travel day um, the bus we've been traveling around in a bus there's 33 of us on this tour today we are headed to the castle which is the first pit stop so let's go the accommodation spent the last two nights here in osaka at the hotel sabiel it had a good view from the one corner window this teeny tiny room i guess best described as a private hospital room had a bathroom slash ensuite size no bath it was comfortable for the limited time we actually spent in the room gotta love a good breakfast right breakfast has been included as usual with our tour package with Tripadil buffet style this one want too bad for the two days let's go it'll be a bit of street food on the way Getting there. There he is with his flag waving. <laughs> 360 degree view of where I'm currently sitting right now. Tour timetables, peeps. You're always on a mission. I have 20 minutes. I've come to the back of the Osaka castle. I'm here by myself. Um, it's an absolutely spectacular view. Only the sun is like beaming right in my eyes. Um, we will be heading to do some shopping next. Um, and then we will be ending at Hamatsu. I probably pronounced that wrong, but I'll just put it down here um, it's the second today last day of the tour it's been spectacular so far Tripadil 10 day Japan discovery we're not done yet so let's keep going so from that entrance there come over to this one here to uh, see if you can see the samurai there me always running back to the tour bus Far out. <laughs> always running always running so our next stop today is Shin Shai Bussy apparently this is the place to come to do lots and lots of shopping um, some nice places to eat uh, so let's go going to get myself a decent coffee so this is starbucks take yourself upstairs with your coffee it will give you access to the toilet and this spot it kind of looks like a library it's also got awesome views that spot there is where everyone gets their shot with the glico man this coffee was much needed i stayed here for about half an hour and then i headed out went for another look-see <laughs> Okay, so 
so you get free time to yourself but watch out you could get lost but if you use that there as a landmark then you're gonna be okay because I was starting to panic a bit because I've got to get back to the bus and I was getting a little bit lost but keep that there in your vision and you will be right all right so our last pit stop for today is the Nara Park are we going to spot some deers yeah yeah <laughs> oh well of course we're going to spot some deers but uh the, uh, the kids are going to buy some uh crackers and we're going to feed them and like they are literally like just here <laughs> oh my god i think so well i assume that it's what you feed them <laughs> I'll keep following you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> These ones are not scary because he has to jump there and he's not about to jump. Too hard work. Like I'm Julie. don't seem as vicious as the other ones at the other place. Oh, hey mate. You're just chilling here? You're just chilling. <laughs> hey, hello. Hello. Let him sniff you. Oh. So if you come to Nara Park and you do not spot a deer, crazy for me to even say that, will we spot one? Then you're obviously in the wrong place. Another long day. We are heading to our hotel, so I will probably spot you tomorrow. So we arrived in darkness to our accommodation here in Hamamatsu. We're here for one night. It had a huge lobby, so I was able to unwind before heading up to my room after a long travel day. So this room is a lot bigger than the last one, but as usual, it's a nice accommodation as part of the Chipper Deal package. The room I had to myself, and yes, it did have a bath. If you know me, I love a room with a bath, and yes, I did indulge. Good morning from Hamamatsu. This is the view from my balcony this morning. Can you spot the castle just up there? Oh, this one's looking mighty fine. Oh, this one is super. This buffet is a gig, man. Look at that. Some fruits. Some hot stuff over this way. Let's have a little squiz. So it's our last travel day, Hamamatsu to Yokohama. It's going to be at least a good six hour drive without any pit stops, but of course we are stopping. About a one hour drive and we have made it to our first stop for the day. Good morning, good morning, good morning peeps. It's another day here, it's our last day. We have arrived at any question? this uh, a tea plantation. Konnichiwa. <laughs> Welcome, welcome. Okay, so we have just been outside, uh, got a little bit of a, some history from our guide, um, translated from the main man. We've come up to the museum and you walk into this building and literally it smells of green. Obviously you can smell the tea. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh. Top floor, and we are going to be watching them put all the tea together. She makes it over there. She's making it. 
making the sticks. Now these are different, these are tea bag ones by the looks of things. So this has been our team leader throughout this whole 10 days. This is Oi. Oi. Hello. He has been an absolute champion. He's cheeky and funny and he's given us so much information. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you. And then there's this little wee gift shop in here. Bit of a tea tasting. Does that smell all right? Good. What flavour is that one? Jasmine. Let's have a go. This is the one I'm going to give a taste test to. That one looks like this. It's a green one. Green one. It's cold. So as we make our way back to Tokyo, it is a long, long drive. We have a one hour pit stop. I'll link it here because I can't actually remember. There is this like sky view. We have been told we don't have long enough, so you're not allowed to get on there. But just for reference, there's this sky wheel that you can pop on. Because Mount Fuji is over there in the background. She's covered at the moment by a little bit of cloud. But anyway, you can get a spectacular view from of Mount Fuji right here. It is a time to have a pit stop, um, grab some lunch, just relax because uh, it is a long bus journey back to Tokyo. So the last stop for today, in fact the last stop for this whole tour after 10 awesome days is the border of Kamakura. As usual it is follow the little blue flag. So let's go. Outside you can see very good, very beautiful. Cool. <laughs> yo, my yo. Oh, that big thing, eh? Hey, hey there peeps, I forgot to sign out of the vlog for today. Um, we have come to the end of our 10 day discovery tour around Japan with Tripodil. I hope you have enjoyed tagging along on this little wee Japan mini series. I'm out and about in Yokohama. We are heading back to Australia and uh, tomorrow and as usual if you have liked this vlog give me a like and a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and I will spot you in the next vlog peeps. Boo yeah! Thank you. So all the best to you. See you again, maybe in Australia, maybe in Sydney, maybe in London. I don't know. Yeah. So if I lost it in the airport, there, please call me. Let's go. And that's a wrap, peeps. That's a wrap.